Welcome to our midweek Lenten worship for March 30th, 2022, as we continue to gather on the Wednesdays of Lent here at Augustana Lutheran Church in Boone, Iowa. Jesus Christ, you are the light of the world. The light no darkness can overcome. And the day is almost over. Let your light scatter the darkness. And shine within your people here. <clears throat> Joyous light of heavenly glory, loving glow of God's own face. You who sing creation's story, shine on every land and race. Now as evening falls around us, we shall raise our songs to you. God of daybreak, God of shadows, come and light our hearts anew. In the stars that grace the darkness, in the blazing sun of dawn, in the light of peace and wisdom, we can hear your quiet song. Love that fills the night with wonder, love that warms a weary soul, love that bursts all chains asunder, set us free and make us whole. splendor, every dancing star of night. Make us shine with gentle justice, light us each reflect your light. Mighty God of all creation, gentle Christ to lights our way. Loving Spirit of salvation, lead us on to endless day. May God be with you all, and also with you. Let us sing our thanks to God. It is right to Blessed are you, creator of the universe. From hold you have led your people by night and day. May the light of your Christ make your darkness bright. For your word and your presence are the light of our pathways, and you are the light and life of all creation. Let my prayer rise up like incense before you, the lifting up of your hands 
as an offering to you. O God, I call to you. O God, I call to you. Come to me now. Oh, hear my voice when I cry to you. Let my prayer rise up, Let my prayer rise up like incense before you. The lifting up of my hands as an offering to you. Keep watch within me, God. Deep in my heart, may the light of your love be burning bright. Let my prayer rise up like incense before you. The lifting up of my hands as an offering to you. All praise to the God of all. All praise to the God of all, creator of life. All praise be to Christ and the Spirit of love. Let my prayer rise up like incense before you, the lifting up of my hands as an offering to you. May our prayers come before you, O God, as incense. And may your presence surround and fill us, so that in union with all creation, we might sing your praise and your love in our lives. Amen. In our word time, we continue to use a portion of our Lenten devotional, Grace Unbounded. A reading from Luke, the 15th chapter. His father came out and began to plead with him. But he answered his father, Listen, for all these years I have been working like a slave for you, and I have never disobeyed your command. Yet you have never given me even a young goat. Then the father said to him, Son, you are always with me, and all that is mine is yours. But we had to celebrate and rejoice because this brother of yours was dead and has come to life. He was lost and has been found. Here ends our reading. To ponder. This is from the author Mark Rosen. Forgiveness allows you to shed your toxic feelings and free yourself of resentments so that, so that the original hurt does not continue to oppress you each day. It is something that happens once. We have struggled with our own feelings, searched for meaning, and healed. The process may happen overnight or take years. Now is the time. We had to celebrate and rejoice, the father insists, having grown wise through his ordeal of rejection and shame. He has found a way to restore his own soul and not remain mired in the difficult experience of seeing his youngest son act so selfishly. Realizing that his eldest son is not ready to bring a spirit of reconciliation to the celebration, now the father must take his stand. If not today, then perhaps one day, 
that his eldest son will let go of bitterness and help restore wholeness to the family. This is what God does through unbounded grace. We are given in the name of Jesus. We follow the one who calls us to tables and fonts and acts of healing, where our doubts and bitterness can give way to the wonders of this invitation. Now is the time for us to celebrate and rejoice. Let us pray. The sounds of amazing grace are always sweet and renewing. And we thank you, almighty God, for inviting us to partake of these gifts. Teach us to share them in our broken world so that our transforming justice will appear in our hearts, our homes, and our communities. Amen. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. An angel went from God to a town called Nazareth to a woman whose name was Mary. The angel said to her, Rejoice, O highly favored, for God is with you. You shall bear a child, and his name shall be Jesus, the Chosen One of God Most High. And Mary said, I am the servant of my God, I live to do My soul proclaims your greatness, O God, and my spirit rejoices in you. You have looked with love on your servant here and blessed me all my life through. and mighty are you, O Holy One. Strong is your kindness evermore. How you favor the weak and lowly one, humbly the proud of heart. You have cast the down from their thrones and uplifted the humble of heart. You have filled the hungry with wondrous things and left the wealthy no part. Great and mighty are you O faithful one, strong is your justice, strong your love. As you promised to Sarah and Abraham, kindness forevermore. My soul proclaims your greatness, O God. And my spirit rejoices in you. You have looked with love on your servant here and blessed me all my life
of mercy hold us in love. In peace, in peace, we pray to you. God of mercy, hold us in love. For peace and salvation, we pray to you. God of mercy, hold us in love. For peace between nations, for peace between peoples, God of mercy, hold us in love. For us who are gathered to worship and praise you, God of mercy, hold us in love. For all of your servants who live out your gospel, God of mercy, hold us in love. For all those who govern that justice might guide them, God of mercy, hold us in love. For all those who Grant weather that nourishes all of creation. God of mercy, hold us in love. Keep watch of our loved ones and keep us from danger. God of mercy, hold us in love. For all the beloved who rest in your mercy, God of mercy, hold us in love. Help us, comfort us all of our days. Keep us, hold us, gracious God. Let us pray. Great and merciful God, source and ground of all goodness and life, give to your people the peace that passes all understanding and the will to live your gospel of mercy and justice through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. God, remember us in your love and teach us to pray. Our Father in heaven, Hallowed be your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. Let us bless our God. Praise and thanks to you. May God, Creator, bless us and keep us. May Christ be ever light for our lives. May the Spirit Go now in peace. Thank you so much for joining us for Holden Evening Prayer.